Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when controller is not working with the game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to enable or disable the Steam input. Now for this, you can go to Steam Maker, right click on the game, select properties, and then go to the controller tab, and then over here, disable Steam input. Now you can launch the game and then check the controller. Still not working, then you can even enable Steam input and check which one is working fine for you. Still not working, you can go to Steam, go to settings and then go to the controller tab now over here you can if you have xbox controller you can enable the steam input for xbox controller and then check if if you have like playstation controller you can try all these options first of all try not enable if that does not work you can enable in games you can try enable check which one is working fine for you still not working in that case you can even try to disable and then you can select not enable and then you can check now the next step is to playstation controller user you can use ds4 windows so you can just uh, search for this uh, software so many users for many users this is working so you can just uh, install ds4 windows and then you can configure your controller and then check next step is to update controller using playstation accessories app or xbox accessories app now for this uh, if you have Xbox app, then go to Microsoft Store and then type in Xbox Accessories app and then click on Xbox Accessories and then install it. Once installed, you can open Xbox Accessories app and then connect your controller using the USB cable. So you have to connect your cable using the USB cable. Once it is detected, now click on these three dots. And then over here, if there is any update, you will see update option. You can update your controller and let the update complete. Once the update is complete, now you can check. Now, similarly, if you have PlayStation controller, in that case, uh, you can search for, you can install this PlayStation accessories app. If you already have installed it, then you can just open PlayStation accessories app. So go to PlayStation website and then you can install this playstation accessories app from x playstation website click on download for windows run this exe file install it now once installed you can launch this playstation accessories app and then connect your controller now once you connect your controller it will detect your controller detected if there is any update you will see update option over here in my case, it is already up to date. Now, once updated, now you can launch the game and then check the controller. Next step is to unplug all the external devices. So if you have OTAs, wheel, pedals, any kind of USB adapter connected, disconnected. If you have extra controller connected, sometimes we have extra controller connected, the dongle connected, you can disconnect it, disconnect arcade stick, disconnect multiple monitor. If you have any kind of virtual controller, this is important. So if you have VJoy, etc., you can disable it or uninstall it and then launch the game. The last step is to use wired connection. So if nothing is working, you can connect to your controller using the USB cable and then you can use the wired connection and then check. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the controller working with the game. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.